Okay, so here's the article. Um, some key points I want to go over with you guys. I'm going to give you a little example of what I'm looking for. I, I believe you guys should all have the link to this article. Um, I'll post it in the chat. And if you all wouldn't mind getting on here, kind of reading through it with me. And But I, some key points I want to make about this article is it, it points out how the biodiversity loss and climate change that we're facing today threaten indigenous food systems and, and it could even lead to the potential of erosion or collapse and and this is due exactly to modern farming techniques um, just modern technology industrialization um, they just really destroy the natural systems we have that have worked so well for many years so um, a huge thing I want to point out about this article is that it points out sustainable farming practices. So something like regenerative agriculture, um, which what it does is it revitalizes the soil. It also sequesters energy and offsets greenhouse gas emissions, which if you think about modern farming today is almost the opposite of what it, that does. I, some of the practices, I actually just saw a video today growing corn. Um, in America, we use a, a lot of nitrogen in it to get it really green and get it, uh, you know, and this could go to revitalizing soil. Some would argue that this is a technique to revitalize soil, but what the, the indigenous practices we're using is something called the three sisters, which is growing beans, corn, and squash. Um, all together which is a huge help in revitalizing the soil let me see if I can pull up a picture for you guys 